Uranus beat out Neptune because of a celestial fluke. Our solar system's other ice giant has been relegated to the too hard pile for now. Both Uranus and Neptune are scientifically compelling said Amy Simon, senior scientist for planetary atmospheres, research in the solar system exploration, the vision at the NASA Goddard Space Flight Center, and a member of the committee that prepared the report. But Uranus ranked higher because it is technologically achievable right now. Neptune is much farther away, making it difficult to reach. And we don't currently have the right combination of launch vehicle, trajectory, and propulsion to confidently launch a large flagship mission there just yet. The main reason for that lack of confidence is trajectory. To get to the ice giants, you need a gravity assist from Jupiter. And after 2030, Jupiter is going to be really badly placed for a slingshot to Neptune. That's too soon. And a mission to Neptune would cost at least another $300 million. If this had been a game of musical chairs, Neptune would have been the obvious choice. But Uranus is closer, cheaper, and easier to reach with our current technology. So that's why it won.